Thanks for choosing First News at 5. Good evening, I'm Dave Sess. And I'm Alexis Walters. First at 5, a Boardman teenager still in critical condition after being hit while riding a motorcycle Saturday night in Boardman. Now, First News reporter Brooke Meenahan tells us what his recovery process could look like. She's live now at the scene of that accident. Brooke? Dave Alexis, this is where that motorcycle accident happened Saturday night, right here at the intersection of 224 and Market Street. 18 year old Khalid Abunaj was going eastbound on 224 when he was hit by an SUV trying to make a left turn onto Market Street. Now, this is the uh, video from the scene Saturday. His cousin, who uh, was riding right behind him, tells me he saw the whole thing happen. And according to him, Khaled again was going east on 224, and he was already in the intersection when the light turned yellow. That's when he saw the SUV speed up to make the light in order to turn left onto Market Street, and that's when he hit Khaled. Right now, Khaled is in an induced coma at Mercy Health. He's lost his leg, has a broken femur, and a broken pelvis. I talked to his family and friends. They tell me he had a turn for the worst this morning. Uh, but was able to pull through, and right now he has a long road ahead of him. His condition was so bad. Yeah. Still is, and uh, he pulled through this morning, and we're still hoping he'll come out of this. Okay. He will come out of this because he is strong, God's willing. Now, his family isn't sure what the recovery process will look like. Right now, they're just trying to get him in awake and in stable condition. Now, coming up at 6, I talked to his cousin, like I said, who was riding right behind him and saw the whole thing. I'll have his, his reaction again coming up at 6. For now, reporting live in Boardman, Brooke Meenahan, WKBN 27 First News.